Police are investigating an embarrassing incident at a Brooklyn precinct. Authorities want to know how a teenager under arrest gave officers the slip and escaped out the back door. CBS 2's Magdalena Doris is live in Crown Heights with new information. Magdalena. Mary, today both the officers involved and the teenager who escaped out the back door of this police precinct are in trouble with the NYPD. Police say 16 year old Ramar Perkins jumped a turnstile Monday night, skipping out on paying the 275 MTA fare. That landed him in handcuffs, but not for long. Police say while going through the booking process at the precinct on Carroll Street in Crown Heights, Perkins was uncuffed and ran for a door in the back of the precinct, escaping. The search for the teen lasted five hours before he turned himself in. It's like a movie cops in the sky. You had the big, um, the big trucks, the emergency response vehicles. Now the department is investigating the officers who let him slip away and disciplinary action will be taken. It's not the first time. Last year, six arrestees broke free in as many months. We cannot tolerate it and needless to say that uh, uh, I am not pleased. In December, two officers were quickly disciplined for their mistake when Barry Toon escaped from a squad car in Tribeca. They have had their guns and badges removed and they are totally uh, off the streets. Uh, they will go back for a retraining before they get back. Now the NYPD has to answer to the public. How could something like that happen? Ramar Perkins is now facing theft of service charge for jumping that turnstile and escape charge for leaving out the back door of this precinct. As for the officers involved, when asked by the NYPD, when I asked the NYPD what they were going to do about it, they said they were holding those officers responsible and that they'd be following up with an investigation. We're live in Crown Heights, Magdalena Doris, CBS 2 News.